Hello, it's Keith. How are you doing? I have got my trusty armor. Um, an enchanted stone sword. <laughs> Whoops. I've got my blue shoes on. Yeah. Okay. Um, basically, what I am doing is I am going to head to the nether. Got plenty of shovels. And I am going to get some of that soul sand. Because I stole all the soul sand on the server. And, you know, you just don't do that. Now remind me, when I come out, to get rid of that. Because that's ugly. Yes. Looks like somebody has stolen some bricks up here too. But anyways, let's see what we can find. See if I can find any of that slow soul sand. Still want to call it slow sand after all these years. No. All right. There won't be much soul sand in there. Where's my exit? There's my exit. Do what I did in the other video. Just hope I don't fall. Or get attacked by that thing. Okay. Better. I am going to leave myself some markers this time. Because last time I had a little problem. Because my sense of direction sucks. So I'm just going to wander and find some uh, soul sand. It's usually not that hard to find, so I should be able to find it real quick. And I imagine I should go the opposite direction of... Looks like somebody's building some sort of... Can I get this now? With Do I have a... I do have a pick of worth. Am I able to get that? Where did that go? Nope. Okay. Suck. I gotta learn how to do this mod, obviously. I still don't know what I'm doing. But you know, it's a slow learning curve. And I'm slowly learning it. Okay, soul sand, anybody? Looks like this would be the gravel level. Soul sand not over there. I even brought a bow this time. And I enchanted it too. Good and all that, um, coal can I actually get you some levels. I should be down here attacking the quartz stuff, but it doesn't look like people are too gung-ho on getting it on the server, so I'm pretty sure it's going to stay there. There's a mid-air glowstone type thing. Where's my last beacon I want to be able to try and make these within visual shot of each other there it is I'm really quite surprised I don't see any soul sand yet anywhere maybe they had a huge soul sand party what is that a darkling Okay. Are you coming after me or something? Okay. The hell was that? Hmm. What was the morphin mob? I can find out what the. It looks like some sort of. Crazy extraterrestrial rat. 
Yeah, I've killed lots of stuff. I actually got killed twice by silverfish. That was a fun time. That was a real fun time. That just made my day. Okay. So there's my thing. Where was I heading? Should I head over here? Let me see if I can find some stuff over in this direction. I guess we'll, whoops, put the torch there, the torch there. Wow, man. Oh, am I a, I'm a bat. Can I fly now? Oh, I can. Oh, this should be cool. Hello, I am back. Saved myself from imminent death. I'm still a... Whatever. And I have been turned around. Now that I've been flying. So let's just go in the general direction of east till I can find one of my... Ah. Things like that. That kind of tells me which direction to go. Okay. I want some soul sand. Comprende ese pinche gordito. I want some soul sand. And I have come across some. Excellent. Excellent. Let me turn into a human because being a bat is cool and all that, but geez, geez. So, yes, now that I've got some soul sand, I will be back. Um, you guys can see me return it. So I have basically gotten all the soul sand that I want so I can replenish the warehouse downtown. I don't know exactly what I've gotten, but I've basically ruined or used up all my shovels that I made. So I took a stack and a little, and I'm going to put back like five or six stacks. And I am going to go steal some of this nether rock before um, I head back and I'm also gonna turn into my buddy here yeah that's right and let's go figure out how to get back so we need to head, that's the wrong way, east. Okay. Hopefully I will see where I came from pretty quickly. And then I'm going to take down my... Hey. There's one of my markers. It's too easy to get lost. <laughs> And, uh, die. You're pissing me off. Oh, now I can be a gas too in here? Great. Just what I wanted to be. Gas. Okay. So we got a nice ass temple here. Which lots can be done. 
And we also have this. Somebody's been spending a whole ton of time down here. Where are you shooting me from? Um, not 100% sure what they're doing. If they're making a ghast. Or you just, oh, they're sucking up the lava. This is where they're getting all their lava. Speaking of lava, do I have any? No. Okay. Let's get home. Let's kill this bastard first. Come on. Thank you. Do I get a gas tear at least? Yes, I do. <laughs> this must be really funny looking. Uh, hi! I can't get far enough away from you. <laughs> Again, enough with the morph mob. Back to my real self. Hi! Okay, let's get out of there. Where was the... there is that? Oh, excuse me. Uh, I don't even have a flint and steel. Just in case this guy. There's another one attacking me from somewhere. Oh, is that it? I can hear you. Go out here. Well. Let me get rid of those blocks. Then go back home. Eat something. Uh -huh. Eat something. Oh, glitch me up to the top. We know you can do it. Thank you. Um, where is my cheat? That I came up here with. There it is. Did I do a 360 to find it? So now that I have what I promised I was going to get... Which is the soul sand I stole from the warehouse. Let me replenish it. Come on. And here we go. We make that change a lot. I guess these have got to be on our bottom bar. I hope this makes up for me taking the lead to the mount I did. Now you guys can have plenty of... What am I doing? How do we get it in there? There we go. Oh, what's going on? Have they frozen again? Sun's moving. That's working. Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. Now that the server has caught up to me, or vice versa. That's all my soul sand. Yay! We repaid our debt with the soul sand. Now I'm gonna... 
go away and cry a little while and figure out why I'm having so much trouble with the server. Um, and when I come back, I'm going to have a an idea, hopefully, for these walls. Make it look good. So, till then, I'll uh, see you in a minute. Hello, Bye. I am back. And I have incorporated a design that I am going to show you guys right now. And what I've done. Um, so I still have one more floor to make look better. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to get attacked. I have killed twice. Been killed twice. On this server. Because of those evil things. I don't know. They don't like me. And it's not like when... I noticed when I was in extreme biomes before, you could tell when something is silverfish before it breaks. But for some reason here, you can't really do that as well. Drop off some crap. Um, so like the, um, in an extreme biome, the silver fish blocks break slowly, even with a diamond pick, but, uh, not here. That's kind of frustrating, because, uh, you want some sort of knowledge that something's going to jump out at you and make your life a little less happy before it comes out. <clears throat> so basically every floor I've lined the outside perimeter with whatever this is. Marbled cobblestone stairs. Then I have these beautiful little blocks that are made with this chisel that's my hand here. You right click on that and bring it brings up a menu and you can put in a box and um, make the boxes look different. So that is the floor done. This is kind of like not the um, the best looking room because the real goods are in here, and so this is the more sophisticated room. But this room is... Hmm. I guess I need to make more stairs. Um, this room is good for some stuff. It's kind of the storage room for each row. So I also line a thing of stairs up top because... You know, it just gives more levels and... It makes things, I don't know, more interesting, especially if you place the stairs correctly. So I did that. And then I have the not so great, um, what is this? Stone brock chiseled, so they're a little smoother. And then I also put a design in each wall. So, in this particular case, cut those out, line it with that stone block, and add these other things that you chisel with the stone block also. Do the same on the other side. So this is what I've been doing all afternoon on each level, is just redoing making designs and stuff and um, making it look less I don't know less plain <laughs> there's gonna be a better word for that here I'm gonna try and remember what I have here but I drawn a blank right now I know for a fact I got this, like that, 
this like that and I'm pretty sure I'm just throwing those in the center like that I'll go check on that in a second because it's not too hard to eat uh, change them out because uh, even if you break these chiseled blocks um, you get them back as that chiseled thing and if you by accident do the wrong chisel let me show you um, let me respond okay so you can't do anything with that see all the little chiseled options so I have it marbled right now so I have it chiseled to that say I didn't want the marble that I wanted this now I have a whole bunch of light creeper marble but I can throw this back right in there and make it back to the original stuff which is ultra awesome because I spend half my life hitting the wrong buttons and it's nice to be able to recover when you do things like that yeah. I'm gonna add a little more light take out light there make that like this then put another glowstone and they need more glowstone dust I think that's what I had for this room is there anything missing <clears throat> as you can see looking up I've made multiple copies um <laughs> now the next part we're getting into the better room so we're gonna take this wall out actually you know what I should do I should do these stairs first so I know exactly where the stairs are I I'm not lining the walls with that stair though I'm lining the floor with that stair this is what the floor is just because it's on the ground it's gonna be a little worn compared to the stairs that I have up on the ceiling what happened there I hope you guys end up liking my building style because you know, I'm not saying everything's going to be exactly the same but I kind of like that Roman architectural uh, flair bizarre stuff I like a lot and um, I always tend to include earth or water and fire elements in, in the build oh. just like everything else I make a circle around it then I place the accent box in the middle and did I run out of those accent box I guess I did That's weird. so what I do is I put the chisel there I put in some cobblestone and there's some more of those accent box that I like to use here and uh, clop 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 so it kind of does show on this side too but um, let me go get some more stuff for the stairs unless I happen to have some hidden in here somewhere um, try not to let you see what I've done. I mean, it's not the greatest thing in the world, but it sure beats some stuff. Um, run to the warehouse. I've also realized I'm going to have to replace a whole bunch of um, this stuff right here. Okay, I am back. I'm going to make some more of these stairs um, I probably need 30 let's just go with that right now let's see what happens there we go um, where's the end of my stair making ability where are you did I finish it Nope. Come on. Let's 
So I know it's a little weird having the stairs dip down right before the dirt, but I kind of like that look. And if you don't like it, let me know what I can do better. And there's always better, and better is always um, somebody's opinion. But, like I said, there's always better. So, I also do this, but instead of the normal stairs, we get kind of a polished air up here because this is a more polished room. I don't know what that is. So, let's hit the outside. Oops. And a lot of my inner rooms do this. It's, I don't know. With a little of nothing, but it does a lot to <laughs> Nah. He's up on the moon. Um Jeez Louise. It does a lot to accentuate a room. So I enjoy doing this a lot. Um, yeah. Oh, one off. Shoot. Let us build that there. So now that we got all the stairs done, we can finish up the walls and. The only reason why I'm bringing you through this little bit of a tedious process is just so you see how I made this. Um, right now you're probably still going, what the hell is he doing? That doesn't look good at all. But ultimately, it will. At least, <laughs> in my eyes, it, it will. Um, I just want to see something. It's just one, okay. So this really should be like this. Oops. I think I need some more. No, let's get the crack thing out. Let's go like that. We can go like that. There we go. I think that's how it's supposed to be. That's how it is supposed to be. We need a little meat. A couple more there. I don't know. I like those those blocks. And this is where it gets a little entertaining. This is a part I like because it accentuates fire and it does um, some water too. You can't get, go wrong with water. And a lot of my light source comes from that. And I go like this around the top. Take these out. Put the smooth ones up there like that. And make the pillow. <laughs> pillow? Pillar there. I wouldn't really be doing anything else today. Ah, fuck. Um, because my girls are someplace else. So let's see. We can go like this. And the water coming down. That's probably why I had the I'm going to replace the edges with the proper stuff. So it looks cool even if you swim through. You can see it's all whatever that quartz is. So there's my fire and water. Yay. So as you see, um, I'm going to do that with the rest of this place. And then I'll show you the results. Okay, I was gonna do the whole thing with you, but this is taking way too long. 
So I'll show you the results when it's done. Okay, I am back. I am done with this floor. Um, with a couple of mistakes, I guess. I am not actually 100% completely done, but you get the idea. Um, the fire and water. Um, so let me finish up. I just wanted to kind of give you a heads up on what I'm doing. I have this row around the top. I think it works wonderful with the dirt ceiling. Okay. That is not true. Let's see what I got here. I'm going to have to turn these into those. Oh, I already got some of those. So let's get out of the slow stuff. I'm going to take half of these, make them into these, and the other half I'm going to make um, into these. I may need more of the second ones. But uh, basically on the ceiling, I do that. I am definitely going to need more of these, I think. And outline it with this. You know, kind of give it the real... Uh, I'm, I'm not saying Colosseum, Roman Empire type stuff, but... This is what I enjoy to make, and you can classify it however you want. I classify it. It makes Keith happy, and seeing it makes Keith happy. Keith enjoys doing it. Oops, ran out with only a couple more to go. So, let's make some more of those. Well, actually... See, we can interchange these. Let me finish these up. I put those on top of these. For some reason, they make a big deal and make it more <clears throat> Roman or... I don't know what makes it look. For some reason, just adding those makes it more blocky, I guess. So with the rest of these, I can... Just take the ones I'm not going to use and switch them over to these so I can finish them up so it's like not a waste of blocks, which is awesome with the chisel. And I think I am done. So this is what each one of these floors is looking like. So when I go up, let me come down. I guess it's easier to come down. <clears throat> Okay, so when you come down, just go down. There's wheat, there's uh, potatoes, carrots, and this crap. And if you really wanted to be sneaky, get around, you can, you know, the easiest water flows to get to the different floors. It's really not sneaky. You can probably hide in here. Nobody would even notice. Oops. Gonna die. So, yeah. So these are gonna be my farming rooms. Um, initially, you may have noticed that uh, in first drop into it was from over here. But I am taking this out. I'm going to fill up this hole. Because I don't need to go downstairs anymore this way. Um, so... That's what it's going to be. So, somehow... I am going to make this hole part of this building. But right here, the way to get in... 
Um, doesn't make sense, so I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Somehow, I think I'm going to... What is right there? I don't know what I'm going to do. And sneaky hide something here. <clears throat> That's my entrance into the my Wii. I don't know what I'm gonna do. But at least that let me know is that it's there. So I hope you enjoyed. I want to kill you. I want to kill you so bad. All right, this is Keith, okay, made his corner. Appreciate you bearing with me while I build my farms and direct decorating them and getting some extra soul sand into the warehouse. Um, next episode, what are we going to do? I have no idea. So why don't you let me know what you want to see me do in the comments below. Okay, tell me what you want me to do. I haven't really thought about it yet. And, uh, have a good day. <coughs> Excuse me. Have a good day. Let's go. Bye. See ya. Yeah. See you later, guys. Hey.